Hello, my name's Clint. I'm your instructor, and this is Math 244. Uh, today we're going to do a short video about um, the nature of class, and um, ordinarily I would start with the syllabus, but the syllabus is not the most important thing that's going to govern this class. It's the calendar. So let's start with that. So here you go. We're right here. Uh, on Monday's lecture, it's the introduction, introductory lecture. We're not going to do anything that involves math today. But the way that courses, the class is lined out would be according to if this were to meet in person. So uh, ordinarily, math classes are off on Wednesday. They go Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. And this is what we'd be doing, uh, covering in Math 244 on any given day. And so what I will do is I will post a video covering that content. So today is the video for the introduction. Tomorrow I'll post the video that has uh, content from section 1.2, terminology of differential equations, and so on. So at any point in the quarter, you'll know exactly where we are, or where we're supposed to be. Now, um, Class on Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday is asynchronous. In other words, we're not meeting. On Friday, we will be in person, okay? And Friday, there won't be a lecture. There will be a video posted for Friday, but there won't be a lecture for Friday. Instead, we're gonna be taking in-person assessments. So that means a quiz or a midterm. There are two midterms, okay? They are tended to, they're uh, scheduled for Friday of week four and Friday of week seven. Okay. Every other Friday, except for the first Friday and the last Friday, um, we will have a quiz. Okay. And what will that quiz cover? Well, it will cover what the homework is that you will be turning in. So, switch pieces of paper. What's the homework? Well, here's the homework. Okay. Uh, homework number one is going to be due on October 1st. It's going to cover these sections which will be on this quiz on the same day. Okay, so at any, uh, at you have for the rest of the term, all the assignments that you will be given, the assessments, which day they will be on, and what content will be covered. So for on October 8th, homework number two is gonna be section 1.7, 2.1, covering these problems, and uh, you will have a quiz on that same day over this content. Now, the quiz will only be on the homework that you're turning in, okay, or the content pertaining to the homework that you're turning in. The midterm will be on all the content preceding it. So for midterm one, you will uh, be tested on all the sections that you've received homework on from 1.2 to 3.5. Notice there are some missing sections in here, like section 1.5. We're not going to cover that, so you're not going to have a quiz on it, and you're not going to be asked any midterm questions on it, okay? Now, that changes a little bit on homework number two, or midterm number two. Midterm number two is going to cover the content uh, from homework four, five, and six, but it's not going to cover the same content from one, two, and three. In other words, it's only cumulative in the sense that you need to know information from sections, uh, homework uh, assignments one, two, and three to uh, solve problems for five, uh, homework problems in four, five, and six. But it's not like I'm going to take a midterm question from the first midterm and recopy it or put something that's close to it on the second midterm. However, the final will be cumulative. Okay, so the final, uh, depending on which section you are in, is either going to be on Monday or Friday of finals week. I think that's December 6th and December 10th. Both uh, um, exams are in person and they meet from 7 to 10 in the morning. Okay. Um, so there you go. There's your homework, the assignments, and the due dates uh, for the entire term. Okay. As far as homework goes, I put on a little bit uh, about what the homework protocol is. Uh, staple your homework in the upper left-hand corner. The assignment is not going to be torn out of the spiral binder, okay? So make sure it has clean edges on the side. 
no credit will be work for the uh, given no credit will be given for work that is illegible and you can turn in your homework early but not late now as far as grading goes each assignment is going to be graded at 20 points two problems are going to be selected at semi-random uh, and the grader will uh, grade those two problems so half of your homework is going to be uh, score is going to be determined by two problems. The other half is going to be determined by your complete listen, completeness and neatness. Okay, your lowest homework score will be dropped. Okay, how many do you have? You have nine homeworks. So the best eight of nine count. Okay, uh, you can work in groups, although the work that you're doing has to be your own work. It's not your neighbor's work. It's not your friend's work. It's not your roommate's work. And it's uh, uh, not the solutions manual's work. Okay. It's got to be yours. If you cheat, you're going to get a zero. Okay, So don't do it, please. Uh, the most important note on this sheet of paper is right here. Uh, these problems are necessary but not sufficient for understanding. In other words, you may have to do more problems than what are listed to fully understand the topics. But to understand the topics, you need to be able to do the problems that I've listed. Okay, So this is... Uh, uh, the minimum that you would have the problems assigned or the minimum that you would have to understand to do well in the class okay so there's your calendar just to reiterate Monday Tuesdays Wednesdays uh, sorry Wednesdays we wouldn't have class Monday Tuesdays Thursdays we won't have class we'll be in class Friday no lectures though okay they're all going to be in-person meetings where you're taking an assessment, except for this coming Friday, the 24th, and the last Friday of class. All right. So, back to where I should have started, which is the syllabus. Okay. So, this is the syllabus for Section 3. If you're in Section 1, you'll follow along accordingly. Okay. Um, office hours are Monday, Tuesday, Thursday via Zoom. There's the Zoom link right there. Um, they are actually not from 1.30 to 2.30. Oh boy, I just found a typo. Um, they're from 10.30 to 11.30. I'm sorry that didn't get fixed in the editing phase of uh, um, the syllabus. So it's Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, from 10.30 to 11.30 a.m. Uh, for both classes. Again, I apologize. Um, lectures hybrid. Okay, so we're asynchronous Monday, Tuesday, Thursday. And on um, Friday, we're in person. So this is the Section 3's syllabus. So we'd be meeting from 8 to 9. Section 1 is meeting bright and early from 7 to 8 in Building 38, Room 227 for both um, sections. There's your book. This is the grading breakdown, 5% allocated to homework, 15% uh, to quizzes. The other 80% are two midterms and a final. The final counts for 30%. The midterms count for 25% each. Um, letter grades are um, the standard, okay? These are minimum guarantees, so that means a student that earns an 80% can get no less than a B minus but a student that earns a 79% can get a B minus. So I reserve the right to go up, not down. Um, as far as the rest of it goes, I kind of talked about it already. Homework is already assigned, okay? And will be collected at various points for the quarter. I mean, Friday, the dates are given to you. Uh, your lowest uh, score gets dropped. Okay, you have to turn it in on time. And if you're going to be gone because, you know, you're part of the band and the band is, you know, at a university related event, well, then uh, we can make a deal on when to turn it in. But if you're not there because you wanted to go snowboard snowboarding somewhere, well, then that doesn't count. Um, Exams kind of talked about it uh, again section three you're gonna have your final on Friday December 10th from 7 to 10 uh, Quizzes are on Fridays as well uh, I'm gonna use the class email as my form of communication Okay, so 
uh, I, I've struggled with canvas. I don't know if I know it well enough um, to make use of all of its features. So I'm just gonna stick with what I've given you, okay? All the PDFs, you'll have everything that you need. Um, all the U videos are gonna be uploaded to YouTube, okay? Um, the link for YouTube is right there, okay? So right now there's no videos posted. This will be the, well, I guess this is the first video that'll be posted. So there's one, the one that you're watching right now. Um, but I will communicate you with you through the class email. Um, please uh, respond uh, through my email address. That's chalbeck at, without the K at calpoly.edu. Uh, telephone, probably not gonna work all that well. Uh, Zoom from 10.30 to 11.30 will work really well on Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday. Uh, you can use a non-graphing calculator. I really don't think that's gonna help. Okay, this is not gonna be uh, a class like your Calc 1, 2, 3, or 4. This is gonna be a little bit different, okay? Where calculators, I don't think, are gonna be all that helpful. But if you want a scientific calculator because it makes you feel better, by all means, bring it. Um, your responsibilities as a student. Uh, one, attend class regularly. Well, I guess since we're having assessments on Fridays, you shouldn't miss Friday, okay? But keep up with the videos. Again, I'm gonna post them on or before the day that um, we are set to cover that content. So don't get behind. Um, ask questions, that means, you know, you're gonna attend Zoom and, uh, sorry, you're gonna uh, watch the YouTube videos, but attend Zoom office hours. Uh, don't procrastinate with your work. Um, and here's the cheating policy. Okay, if you need to familiarize yourself with that, but the most important thing is to be honest with yourself. You're at a quality school and it's gonna take a great deal of effort uh, to, distinct, to uh, distinguish yourself from everybody else. Okay, so if you're really committed to getting an A in the class, you're really gonna have to work uh, much harder because you're with a group of individuals that are equally as talented as you are, okay? So hopefully I got through everything. Again, this video was meant to be short and to the point, may or may not be comprehensive. So if you have questions, please feel free to ask, um, and send me an email. Uh, if it's a question that pertains to everybody and that I should have addressed, I'll take your question and I'll kind of, uh, um, email the class alias with the question and the answer. I'll keep your identity private, so don't worry about that. Okay, uh, I hope you're all doing well and uh, best of luck this quarter. Let's have a good one. Take care.